Hey, Terrell, I, I remember um, talking to you a few weeks ago when this, when you're basically on, on the verge of uh, having this role that you have now, basically, and you talked about wanting to show people the kind of pl player that you are and also, you know, pick up where, where Justin left off. What's it meant to you to uh, do it in the way you have here in the last three weeks, having a sack in three straight games? Um, it's been good, obviously. Um, did well, I guess. I, I'm always more critical of myself, so I know it's like the stuff that I could have done too. In terms of being more um, critical of yourself, what do you mean by that? Is, is that just like plays you left on the field, or I guess how do you assess yourself yeah. in that way? Yeah, definitely the plays that I left on the field, definitely the plays where I could have. I, I saw things I could have done better. Like, I feel like I was supposed to have a pick yesterday. Right. And, and I guess also just, you know, what, what's it mean to be able to be performing like you are right now, especially after, um, you know, as, as I'm sure, you know, people have mentioned before, just, you know, kind of the, the everything you dealt with your rookie year. And then, um, like I said, just being able to have the chance to really show the player that you feel like you're um, capable of being. Well, it's a blessing. It's a start, definitely. But I'm just happy to be able to be able to be on the field as consistently and just be able to contribute and help this team reach our ultimate goal. Thank you. Gary? Hey, Terrell. Um, just wanted to check with you in regard to kind of managing your... Why do you got me pause? <laughs> What's that? Um, no, go ahead. Uh, just wanted to ask you just in terms of managing, you know, your your knee and, and just kind of your body um, through a full season, how that's going and, and what kind of goes into that? Um, I mean, the only managing at this point really is just kind of like through the week, probably just one day to where I get to focus on basically recovery, recovery and stuff like that. But outside of that, it's really not not much different if anything is just the one day off of practice on Wednesdays where we have 20 plays on the field so I get 20 plays off a week mm -hmm. um how about just you guys collectively as you know outside linebackers edge rushers with Leonard and Obo making a play you playing well um how 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 would you kind of describe that that group of of guys um, well, we just wanted to make sure when Justin kind of got hurt, we didn't want to have any drop off, and we we felt challenged as a group. Me, Obo, and and Flo just felt like you know what I'm saying we want to show that we still have one of the best groups in this league, and not talked about enough. So just wanted to kind of elevate our level to where we think who we, well basically just play to who we know our who we who we know we are our standard. Thanks very much. Uh, Stu? Hey, Terrell, just one, one quick follow-up question. Is there anything that you learned from last year, just you know, working with the training staff and everything that um, you applied to this year as far as you know, managing your health that's allowed you to kind of optimize your performance? I mean, it, I'm sure it could be as simple as just the rest day, but I wasn't sure if there was anything else beyond that that's kind of contributed and helped. Um, I've picked up on a little little habits that I kind of stuck with me, like getting into the sauna more and things like that, like one little extracurricular things where it's like some certain stuff that you see the vets and the older guys doing like and picking up on, oh, that's how that benefits you and, and just kind of using it into my routine, things like that. Thank you. You guys all set or any more questions? I think Gary had one more. You got one more, Gary? Uh, let's see. I guess so. It, yeah, I do. <laughs> I mean, we he touched we touched on it, but um, Terrell, what have you kind of uh, taken from Leonard Floyd? I mean, in terms of technique or just mental, what kinds of things, if any, helped you with? Flow, I mean, obviously just watching him, you can learn a lot from how he plays with his mentality, but also his feel for the game is crazy. Like just knowing how to react off other people's playing 
and also still being himself within a play like certain, certain times he knows it's not a coincidence that he's in the right place at the right time a lot of times he just kind of had that feel for the game so kind of just mimicking him and watching how picking his brain and seeing how he thinks and just having conversation with him all the time about even simple stuff just as far as just like oh, okay he played off of ad or played off of somebody else's brush seeing that okay they're winning their rush okay let me get here or he's winning his brush and he can already kind of get a feel for how the quarterbacks are going to move or step up things like that and even just like him reacting to certain plays and off of different looks we, we talk a lot of times about this even like knowing what type of plays we're going to get situation wise and things of that nature so picking his brain has always helped me add to my own game